Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. The one main thing in Vodafone Idea Limited is that, guys, you should note from I, I think 13th of February is the result of this company. We already intimated to our friends that uh, Vodafone will be having the results previous week itself. But the main factor you should know now we are going to discuss how would be the result because. The price impact is negative today, so people will think that World of Another episode is going to be very very bad. So guys, here we are going to see how will the results come for World of Another Limited. So I want you just to listen this video really carefully because I think you could get several value points from listening to this video guys. And the first point you should note is that till now Supreme Court Asia issue has not been come. Second point is that the expectations that Supreme Court may extend the due date of extension probability is 80% if you compare to 100%. 80% is for yes and 20% is for no. Which means there is a positive side on the Asia impact extension of due dates according to us so people you may ask me what is the reason how you can say 80 percent probability guys two things you should note one is that government already said that they are aiming aiming for lakh crore of revenue from telecom department without the inclusion of ajr amount so that is the key hint the second hint is that Government also said that you are aiming for 5G spectrum tower auction. We also already posted a video about that also maybe 2 to 2 to 3 days back. In that we said if government wants revenue from 5G spectrum use, they want several telecoms to live. If this AGR issue happens at a peak time, then no telecom department will survive because one major exiting and another two players will think whether to buy now or to buy later because they will guys simply think only two competitors are there the whole market is with them and people not interested to go to 5G market because there are less competitors and these players will roll on win 4G itself so how will government get the extra revenue that is second point so AGR impact will be positive so the Third point I'm going to say is very very important guys. Please listen carefully. The impact of results. How will the results be? Now we're going to see how will be the results. First basically now let us move to the previous result because I want you to see the previous result guys. As you can see here the revenue from operations is just 10,804 crore. So how will the revenue be tomorrow? I think our calculation is that revenue may increase tomorrow. How you can say it? If you ask me, guys, I will give you the example because all three companies, Vodafone Idea Limited, Airtel Limited, and Airtel Limited and Reliance Company, I mean Reliance Limited, also increased the tariff in this month. I mean the three months slot, they have increased their tariff. So average revenue per user, they will call it shortly as ARPU. ARPU is nothing but average revenue per user. So with this effect, we can see at least 11,100 crore, 11,500 crore to 11,800 crore as a minimum revenue impact. Yes, due to increase in revenue prices, some some subscribers also left from the telecom, I mean from the Vodafone. But that is not a matter because the revenue would be stabilized from other subscribers. So next point you should note in Idea Limited is that the amount of loss this company is going to earn guys that is already fixed because even though this company is earning operating profit without this interest cost after this interest cost this can this companies can earn a loss of around 4800 crore but if we compare the pre I, I we are our calculation is that the loss can be in the range of 3800 crore to 4500 crore because of this interest impact but if we compare with June quarter, the net loss is normal or net loss has been minimized because there's only one key hope for Vodafone Limited investors and also to all 
the main factor is that the ACR issue is on hanging. There are no hints of information regarding these guys. But people, if you ask me uh, whether I would invest, if you ask me, guys, I would rather invest in this company at these prices because we are still expecting a positive impact from the government. I hope government does not lead a telecom party to like exceed because if a telecom party exceeds, that is not a problem to that co that company alone, but it's a, it is a revenue loss to the government because we already said before two companies there no want to in invest in 5G uh, only invest in 4G so a competition is much so word of idea will be there so uh, if you ask me why then price has fallen today we already said guys the main reason is that due to the result impact which is going to come on tomorrow some small investors some medium investors want to create panic so they came out some small investors will, will think that tomorrow it result is negative only so we can buy we can come and buy tomorrow at less price that can be also situations and also short things these three things mainly rotate in this market guys and this is what we want to say about the word of unlimited and we again saying what you have said guys 11,500 crores to 11,300 crores would be our revenue estimate and net loss can be in the range of 4,400 uh, from 3,800 crores to 4,500 crores or maybe banks from 4,800 crores would be our loss estimate if it comes in the range we can see a target of around uh, 5.35 to 5.75 because it is a good impact but a loss impact guys this is about Odefinite Limited and see you in the video very soon